The Boom supersonic jet are becoming very popular in the airline industry and American Airlines are going to become the third airline to place orders for the Boom supersonic jets and we're going to talk about it. If you are new here, subscribe to receive quick updates about aviation. The Boom supersonic jets are being made by a company called Boom Technology Inc. The company was founded in 2014 and it could make a lot of money from manufacturing these jets. The aircraft is scheduled to go into production in 2024. When the aircraft appears in the market, it's going to cost $200 million. The new aircraft has the capacity to carry 65 to 88 people. American Airlines have ordered 20 of these aircrafts, which means it is going to cost $4 billion for the airline. If the aircraft is good, they are considering ordering more aircrafts. American is the third airline ordering the Boom supersonic jets. The first two are United Airlines and Virgin Atlantic. But why are Boom Technology Inc. making this aircraft? Founder Blake Scholl said, Ultimately I want people to be able to get anywhere in the world in 5 hours for $100, £83. This means that the flights with this aircraft will be cheap for passengers. How about the distance it can travel? The revolutionary new aircraft can travel 4,250 nautical miles, which is 4,890 miles. It's also faster and decreases the time spent in the air. Let's talk about a travel from London to New York. With existing aircrafts, it takes 6.5 hours. However, with the supersonic jet, it will only take 3.5 hours, which increases the efficiency for air travel. With less time taken for travel at an affordable price, this is good news for Boom Technology Inc. However, is it a good idea for airlines to buy this type of plane? One reason why it's a good investment for an airline is because of efficiency. If it takes less time for a plane to travel to its destination, this means that the airline can operate more flights in one day. This means more money for the airline. However, buying these types of aircrafts may not be a good idea because of the cost. The aircraft costs $200 million each. For this money, you can buy an alternative plane from Boeing or Airbus for a cheaper price and also has more seats. Should airlines invest in buying the new type of aircrafts? See you in the next video.